You've got the relationships, you've got the infrastructure, you've got you've got the knowledge of how to get things done. And 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 those relationships really are important in in, in government. Important because I can't tell you uh, all the appropriations I asked for in that last budget. I got every single one of them. Hmm. And a large part of why I was successful in that is because a lot of those chairs, those appropriation committees that handled the different types of appropriations you're asking for have at one time or another had something before me and my judiciary committee or another committee that I was chairing, and I've helped them out. And that's why when you go to Raleigh, if you jump up and down, really, you're not going to get anything done. You go up and be civil and, and act like a statesman and work with others. You don't have to agree with everybody all the time. There are Republicans I don't agree with. There are Republicans that don't agree with me. But the point is we're civil about it. We work together, work across the aisle, and you can get things done. And when you help others, when your time comes up, they will help you. And that takes a a, a lot of work because you have to develop those over a period of years. Uh, And I've been able to do that. I'm very proud of having been able to do that. I don't speak on a soapbox very often. I really do. And I don't toot my horn very often. People tell me I don't do it enough. Uh, and, and maybe by this podcast, I'm doing a little bit, but uh, that's not why I'm up there. I'm up there to help people. That's why I ran for office. That's why I've been in office. Uh, and I enjoy it the most when somebody comes up to me and says, Davis, I really appreciate what you did. I mean, that means the mm. world to me. 